Right now, at this very moment, time is dying at the edge of everything you've ever known. We measure time in seconds, minutes, years. We build our entire existence around it. But what if I told you that time isn't universal? That at the furthest reaches of our cosmos, time doesn't just slow down, it stops completely. Einstein discovered something terrifying. Time is relative. It bends. It stretches. It breaks. The faster you move, the slower time flows. But there's a limit. A cosmic speed limit. The speed of light. Now imagine you're standing at the edge of the observable universe, looking out into the void. Light from beyond that edge will never reach you. Not in a billion years. Not in a trillion. Never. Because the universe is expanding faster than light can travel. Those distant galaxies are racing away from us, approaching the speed of light itself. And here's where it gets strange. From our perspective, time for those galaxies slows down. Seconds become hours. Hours become centuries. As they approach that cosmic horizon, time begins to freeze. Stars stop burning. Galaxies stop spinning. Reality itself grinds to a halt. But here's the twist. From their perspective, time flows normally. It's us who are frozen. It's our universe that has stopped. Time doesn't stop at the edge of the universe. We stop at the edge of time. The edge of the universe isn't a place. It's a moment, an eternal now, where past and future collapse into nothing, and we're all racing toward it. You can subscribe or for more videos, and don't forget to like the video.